<laughs> Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Today's video is about thought manipulation. In this video, I'll be explaining how to transfer the shoulder dart to two other different positions. It is preferable that the shoulder that be moved to another position while designing. It makes it easier for you to be able to work with your pattern. There are two techniques involved in dart manipulation. There is the pivot method and the slash method. I'll be demonstrating using the slash method. On the front bodies, measure a point from about 6 cm to 8 cm down from the underarm point. Then rule a line from that point to the tip of the shoulder dot. Then slash open at the shoulder that make sure to cut right to the tip of the dart then slash through the new underarm point pin the shoulder dart and secure with tapes. The shoulder that has been successfully moved to the underarm point. You can go on to place a paper underneath the new dart position. To get an accurate dart cap. Make sure to fold the dart facing downwards towards the waistline. Trim the excess paper. The last step will be to move the new dart about 4 cm away from the bust point. This is done in order to give a relaxed effect in finished garments rather than a pointy or Pokey one. Draw in the new dart. It is also important to note that as you move the shoulder dart to different positions, the length and fullness changes. For the back piece, the dart is transferred into the ammo. Rule a line parallel to the back line from the tip of the dart into the ammo. Slash open the line and slash open the shoulder dart. Pin down the dart and secure with tapes. Place a paper underneath and redraw the ammo. This manipulation adds a little ease to the ammo. It is not sewn. In other designs, it might be required of you to transfer the dart to the neckline. And that's it for the underarm dart. For the second dart position, I'll be transferring the shoulder dart into the waist. On the waistline, cut right through the middle of the dart to the tip of the shoulder dart. Then slash the shoulder dart open.
pin it down with tape you can see it opens up to the fullness at the waist place a paper underneath Fold it out facing the center front. Trim the excess paper. And the last step will be to move the dots away from the apex by 4 centimeters. And with that, your pattern is ready for you to design with. And that's it for this video, guys. Don't forget to like if you have found this video helpful. Feel free to share and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.